Okay everyone, what's going on? Welcome back to Foxtech and in this video I'm gonna discuss how to delete messages on your Apple Watch. Whether you want to clear up space or just tidy up your message list, I'm gonna explain how, you, how it works and how you can manage and delete the messages. First off, it's important to clarify what we mean by deleting Apple Watch messages. If you're thinking about the deleting individual text messages within a chat of your Apple Watch, like the text bubbles, unfortunately, that's not possible. The Apple Watch doesn't allow you to delete individual message bubbles within a conversation. Instead, you can only delete entire conversations. To delete the entire text messages thread, you can simply swipe left on the chat you want to remove. When you do this, a trash can icon will appear. Tap on the trash can icon and then confirm that you want to delete the actual conversation. This will remove the thread from your Apple Watch and it's a quick and very straightforward process, but it is sort of all or nothing situation for the threads. Now, if you are wondering whether you can delete all text message threads and conversations at once, the answer is no. Apple doesn't provide an option to delete all of the conversations in one go on the watch. You'll have to delete each conversation individually by swiping left and confirming the deletion for each one. It's also worth mentioning that deleting messages on your Apple Watch doesn't affect your other devices. For instance, if you delete a conversation on your Apple Watch, it will still remain on your iPhone and other Apple devices. Additionally, the person you are messaging will still have the conversation on their end. So to sum it up, you can only delete entire conversations on the Apple Watch, not individual text messages within a chat, and you can't delete all of the threads at once. So that's how it works. Hopefully, Apple will make some changes in the next watchOS update, but for now, this is everything what you can do about it. Hope you found this video useful. If you did, hit the thumbs up, subscribe below, and I'll see you in the future.